all right guys it's smiley here welcome to the channel before we start i just wanted to show you how the team's kind of cooking up at the moment so 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 we've had a few new arrivals we've got desai i don't know if he's statistically better than saliba who we did have inside there but he's he's very good for links so that's why we're kind of giving him a run it gives us more freedom gives us more freedom so we've got a lot of strikers as well so we've got Didier Didier is there we've got Barcola there as well and we've also got Carlos Tevez which is a new addition as well that I want to try out but it does give us a bit of chem issue so I think that's what we're going to room for now but enough about me flexing the squad let's just have an in-depth an in-depth look at what we've got that's came out today so 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 Gonzalo Montiel is still there um, he's had a bit of an upgrade as well, so he looks he looks quite decent now. 97 pace, which is very good. 89 shooter, which is decent for a right back. Um, 89 passing is okay. Dribbling's all right. Um, 91 defending and 93 physicals as well. He just looks all right to be fair. Um, I think he's still got potentials to get like more upgrades as well. So it's not a bad option. Not a bad option for you Argentina fans. So Mateus and Philip Lama are still there, but it looks like they're going to be ending soon. So get your move on if you would like to do that. Um, 91 plus Encore player pit. It's up to you guys, man. It is up to you guys. I don't know. I did it once and I don't want to do it again. It wasn't that good for me. I think we got foot birthday Burkamp, which wasn't that good. I think what makes this an out is the the fact that they've got birth, ultimate birthdays inside there, which just makes it a bit of an out to be fair. So I've got D, well, Ronaldo. I was about to call him Dino then. Ronaldo's there. If you guys would like to do him, he looks quite deep. He, um, he looks quite decent. R nine's R nine. He's just a bit overpriced to be fair. Um, Camille Abili still there as well. Wayne Rooney. Wayne Rooney. Greats of the game. Looks very good. Looks very good. So he's had an upgrade. 97 rated player, a 98 pace, 97 shooting. I think this is one of the best like Wayne Rooney cards we have seen in a while, to be fair. Statistically, he looks very good. And I think he can get more upgrades as well. I think if England get do do well, score, I think like two more goals. Um, he could do very good. Two or three more goals. So um one of the players that we got today, Clarence Seedor, he looks decent. He looks very good. Um, four star skill moves, five star weak foot, right foot player, five foot none, can play right mid, centre mid, left mid as well. So quite versatile and also can. Um, in terms of uh, statistics, 90 pace, 93 shooting, 95 passing, 94 dribbling, 85 defending, 90 physicals. He looks very good. Um, finesse shot plus, he's got dead ball as well. He's got ping pass, ping pass, ping pass. He's got technical plus as well. Looks very good. He could get upgrades. I think the Netherlands are actually winning 2-0 um, at the moment. Well, last time I, looked, I checked, it was 2-0. Let me just have a have a bit of a look now. Spoiler alert, guys. Spoiler alert, guys. 3-0 full-time. Wow. So, um, he looks like he's definitely going to be getting an upgrade. You've got Cafu here. Let's just have a look at his pricing before I just go on to that. So, um, exactly bronze, silver... 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88. So, in terms of the pricing, he's not that bad. But there are two players I want to talk about. So, Rain Rooney, in terms of his pricing, 18 squads in July. I think it's a bit over the top, man. We're talking 92 rated squads. It's a very good card. It's a very good card. But I just think, why can't EA just let us have fun, man? Why are we putting 18, like doing 18 squads at this time, man. I just feel like, I feel like there's a bit of Man United tax there, man. A bit of Man United tax, a bit of Prem tax, a bit of England tax there. A bit of England tax. People know that uh, Ray Rooney is a very likeable player. Yeah, obviously know, and they've like, put a bit of tax on there. I don't really agree with the price there. So Cafu is also there. And he looks phenomenal. I can't lie. In terms of the card, Five star skill moves, four star weak foot, like can play right back, right wing, like attacking position in 90. Like, look at the state of the stats, mate. 96 pace, no 87 shooter, um, 91 passing, 93 free dribbling, 94 defending, um, 90 physicals as well, man. And he's a good player, man. He just he's just got that aura in game, man. 
he's just got that aura in game like um in terms of he's got whip pass plus to whip pass plus with 90 crossing as well like just looks very good block aerial quick step as well like listen in game it doesn't really matter about the stats sometimes because in game some players just got aura and this Cafu has got aura since the beginning of the game he's just been so good in terms of like the squads though this is the issue that i have man like bronze silver 84 84 87 88 88 88 89 89 89 90 89 92 92 like listen who wants to be paying that much for a right back and you listen if he's your favorite player you're a massive brazil fan you're one of those crazy guys that did the r9 sbc then by all means go ahead sir go ahead but me myself i am not going to be putting 19 squads into a right back at this stage nope definitely not definitely not so luis figo came out he looks decent he looks very good can play five star skill moves um, right bird play right wing and also cam as well right mid very decent card 95 pace 91 shooting, um, you would want that to be a bit higher, I think. Uh, 92 passing, 96 dribbling, 80 defending with the 87 physicals as well. Um, four play styles, ping pass, technical, rapid, trick, um, trickster as well. Play style pluses. Like, he looks like a good card. And the way Portugal are playing, he could definitely get some upgrades as well. I'm not completely against that. And he doesn't look like he's priced as bad as the other two. I was just talking about Rooney and Cafu. So... Bronze, silver, 83, 87, 88, 88, 88, 89, 89, 90, 90, 91. So he also looks decent. I'm not against that. He's, he's actually priced quite well. I wish that they were all similarly priced, but this is it. Um, Caseas is the new one that came out today. So bronze, silver, 82 rated, 84 rated. 86 rated, 87 rated, 89 rated. Like, listen, that's fairly priced. I can deal with that. And you know, like Caseos, I'm not going to go too much in depth into statistics. Like, standout stats, he does have 99 reflexes. But, 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 I didn't know he's left footed as well. He, he, he's always been a good keeper from the start of the game. I think, like, in my personal opinion, this is my opinion from my experiences, I think that him and Petr Cech were the better keepers on the game this year. So, Listen, I'm not completely against that as well. So, um, we did have the 93 plus Make Your Mark and Path to Glory upgrade as well, which I've already completed, but I'll make a separate video on that. I will get uploaded. So, um, do, 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 do. In terms of players that we have got, I think that is kind of. It today it looks like it was the path to glory and we also got Cassius as well so yeah that looks like that was it guys so listen thank you so much for tuning in guys enjoy watching the football enjoy the euros enjoy the rest of your week and you guys take care have a nice